in this particular question, we have to use the substitution method to solve this uh, simultaneous equation. <coughs> so we can start with uh, 2x plus y equal to 11. I'm going to call this equation number 1. Then 2x squared minus y squared equal to 23. That's equation number 2. So, first we need to use a substitution. So, I always choose the one which one has got any coefficient in front of you. So, if I take the first one, so I'm going to call the equation 1, 2, 2, x plus y equal to 11. Therefore, I can write this one equation number 1 again. Therefore, y is equal to 11 minus 2x. I can now substitute y equal to 11 minus 2x into equation 2. So I rewrite the equation. 2x squared uh, minus y squared equal to 23. So now I know that y is equal to 11 minus 2x. So I'm going to substitute that one. 2x squared minus 11 minus 2x, the whole thing squared, equal to 23. So so 2x squared, that open the bracket, that is going to be, if you multiply that, 121 minus 44x plus 4x squared. I'm going to bring the minus 20 to the left as well. Anyway, minus 23 equal to 0. So simplify that. 2x squared expand the bracket minus 121 plus 44x minus 4x squared minus 23 equal to 0. Now if I take uh, 4x squared so that will be minus 2x squared then I can have minus 144x that is 44x and minus 144 equal to 0. I can simplify, divide everything by 2. So minus x squared minus 22x, uh, that's going to be equal to, uh, that's plus 44x, uh, that's going to be equal to minus 72 equal to 0. So I want to get rid of this minus, so I'm going to take the other side. So x squared, uh, that is equal to, that's a plus, so it's going to be minus 22x and plus 72 equal to 0. So if I write that, then I can factorize it. This one is equal to x squared minus 18x minus 4x plus 72 equal to 0. I can pair it now. Take x as a common factor. x minus 18. Here I take the 4 as a common factor. x minus 18 equal to 0. Therefore, x minus 18 equal to 0. So x is equal to 18 or x minus 4 is equal to 0, so x must be equal to 4. So we have two values, which is this one and that one for x. So x is equal to 18 or x is equal to 4. So if we carry on this, so we know that x is
एक्सिस एक्सिस इक्वल टू एटीन एंड एक्सिस इक्वल टू फोर सो नाउ वी कैन सब्सिट्यूट दिस वैल्यू सो आई गोन्ट सब्सिट्यूट एक्सिस इक्वल टू एटीन एंड एक्सिस इक्वल टू फोर इन टू equation number 1 so i rewrite the equation so when x is equal to 18 2 time 18 plus y equal to 11 therefore <coughs> if i do this that is equal to 36 plus y equal to 11 so y is equal to Minus thirty six plus eleven, so y is equal to minus twenty five. Similarly, I can do the other one. X is equal to four. That one, two times four plus y equal to eleven. Eight plus y equal to eleven. So y is equal to eleven minus eight. So y must be equal to three. So the final answer is. When x is equal to eighteen, y is equal to minus twenty five, and x is equal to four, and y is equal to three. So this is the final answer of this particular question. So thank you.